Oh, hi everyone. This video just quick showcases you're probably swimming wrong in Genshin Impact. So, this is how you would normally swim. So close yet so far, you still cannot reach this area without any other buffs. Okay, of course, then people say, right? You need to equip Beido because she reduces your stamina cost and you need double an emo character, right? Right, let's do that then. Same place, same spot, same direction, same starting point. Of course? Yeah, sure. Well, we're, we're, we're definitely making progress, we're using less stamina. Hey, we made it without the without the actual stamina bar reaching red side, right? Now, how about we swim back but without Beto and without any more buff? Guess what? I used even less than having Beidou and having the Animo characters. Now, so you might be asking, how do you actually perform such a trick? Well, um, let me show you while uh, swimming at a longer distance. I don't think that's long enough. Let's try to find somewhere even longer to swim to. Uh, let's try to swim over there. Can you imagine using this technique? work with also the buffs that you have i think you can even swim across that let's test this out i've actually never tried this i've never tried how far this can lead you we're still not having i don't think we have any food that helps you with swimming so let's just use this setup and see how far we can reach and here I'll explain how you actually do this trick. So all you want to do, uh, well for on PC, all you need to do once you have jumped into the water is hold down on your shift button and periodically press on your W buttons. So it's kind of like the reverse you would imagine uh, you dashing around on the ground. All you have to do is hold down the shift button and press W once for a while. Uh, I would imagine on the mobile uh, devices or on the probably controller devices all you have to do is the same hold down the sprint button then move your uh, controller stick or try to move forward once in a while probably on phone or mobile uh, cases that'll be a little bit hard to control but I imagine you can still pull it off uh, the only downside to such a trick that you can use in the game is you can't really control your direction of going uh, really smoothly but if you're only using swimming tricks like this to cover distance then there's no doubt this can cover as far as any uh, land spaces that you majority want to swim across. And well, don't even try to use this to swim across the Inazuma because that won't be the case that you can. Um, anyway, this is how you swim in Genshin Impact and never drown once and or never drown anywhere you will want to swim to.